I wasn't ever thinking I'm going to go to the NFL from this. It was just playing the game because I love to play it. On the field, Sharif Floyd is a man on a mission, but that mission comes from tough and humble beginnings. What was a moment that really changed your life? When I moved out on my own and at 16, just growing up at an early age. Floyd's biological father was murdered when he was three by the man he grew up with and believed to be his dad. I was living in North Philly around the town with my grandmother. My father was in jail and it was kind of a struggle, you know? I mean, but it, it's not all bad memories in there. Floyd turned to sports. Me and my cousin were playing basketball and our basketball coach actually became the football coach of our middle school. And after that, we just decided to play football for him and we learned, we, we were taught from scratch of the whole game of football. Sharif went on to play football at George Washington High School in Philadelphia. After his junior year, he was rated the number one defensive tackle in the country. He then signed to play for the Florida Gators. My three years here, I've grown each year. Um, and when Coach Muschamp and Coach Quinn and Coach Young and all those guys got here, I grew even, even more and even at a faster pace because we had great coaches and great people around us. Now Floyd is NFL ready, but his future goals go well beyond the football field. After I'm done like playing football and hopefully consider one of the best to do it, um, I'm just giving back to my community in Philadelphia. Before I even left high school, during high school, I knew that I was going to get a chance to give back to my community and kids that were in need. I know it's more than just football for me. Sharif also plans on giving back to his grandmother, the one person who has been there for him throughout his life. What's the first thing you're going to buy with that paycheck? My grandmother a house. Put some thought into that. Why is that? Because she struggled well before I struggled or even was even thought of. And I think it's about time she can relax. Relax and know that her grandson's hard work is paying off. You don't just wake up and say, I want to work out, or wake up and say, all right, I've been through this, so let me work hard. It's, it's kind of just getting the mentality of how to work hard, when to play, when not to play, and things like that. So the only thing I know how to do is go hard. It's that work ethic stemmed from the tough and humble beginnings that'll carry Floyd through his NFL career and his life. Julie Quitner, GTN Sports.